And as a doctor, I completely missed it. There's a hidden warning sign in your liver that screams, you're heading for diabetes. And for years, I was blaming the wrong thing entirely. I remember seeing one patient, maybe 12 years ago when I was still training to be a GP. It was a successful guy, mid forties, carrying a bit of extra weight around his middle. You know the type. He'd been for an ultrasound scan of his abdomen to look for gallstones. And the scan had picked up something that we weren't expecting, extensive fatty deposits in his liver. Immediately, my thoughts are running to, is this alcoholic liver disease? So I asked him how much alcohol he drank. Now, this guy wasn't claiming to be abstinent, but he reported very low levels of alcohol consumption. And like many doctors, I'd seen enough patients who'd played down their drinking, so I was a bit skeptical. After all, it's the basic truth of the human condition that everybody lies. That's what we were taught to believe. If there's fat in the liver, there's probably hidden alcohol consumption. Back then, it was the only explanation that seemed to make sense. And I wasn't alone in my thinking. But what we now know is shocking. 75% of people carrying some extra weight have some degree of fatty liver disease, and most don't even know about it. But here's the thing, our understanding of fatty liver disease hasn't just evolved in the last 10 years, it's been completely transformed. The fat in that guy's liver had nothing to do with alcohol. That guy had what we would have called non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Instead of asking how much alcohol he was drinking, I should have been asking about his sugar consumption. In 2020, non-alcoholic liver disease was renamed to MAFLD, or Metabolic Dysfunction Associated Fatty Liver Disease. This name change finally acknowledges what's really going on. This isn't just about being overweight. It's about how your body processes sugar and carbohydrates. Your liver becomes a warning system, showing us that your metabolism is already in trouble. 